made myself some breakfast, eggs, a banana, and orange juice. This should be enough. <laughs> So that's pretty much what I say every day. <laughs> okay, so swim is officially done. Uh, my microphone for the DSLR comes tomorrow, which is good. I uh, also some other stuff is coming too. So that'll be a surprise. But yeah. Okay, so we have to go return my old tripod real quick, and then we will um, head home, and then we'll get started with our day. Okay, we're just turning the stand that's on. Okay, that sounds good. Am I good? Yeah, you're all set. Thank you. Yeah, have a good day. You too. All right, so here's the deal. I want to show you guys just how much better the DSLR is. So I want to do a side-by-side -side video. Uh, this one, the one on the left, uh, or at least this one right here, that is the Nikon camera. This one right here, that one is the Canon camera. Now this is a side-by-side -side video so you guys can see the difference in quality. Now I have them on the exact same settings, so yeah. Warren, you ready? Yeah. All right, first we're gonna have to grab all the bottles. Here, I'm going to back my car up so that way it's easier. Today. Um, I don't know. Once we're done with our chores, we'll figure something out. How you doing, Warren? You like McDonald's? Mm -hmm. A lot. What about mom? What do you think she would say if she knew we went to McDonald's? I'm never letting you go and let you go to McDonald's ever again. Well, I know she'd be pretty silly, huh? Alright, so we're at the ball drop. I'm bringing my smaller camera because it's a little bit less conspicuous. It just seems kind of weird to be filming there. So I'm not going to be bringing big camera in. Hey, Mark, can you close my door for me? Well, that was pretty gross, huh, Warren? Yeah. How gross? Gross as can be! Hey, Warren. What would you say if I said that we should go on the trampoline? Yes. All right, get your stuff on. What do you think, Warren? Is that fun? Yeah. A lot it's of fun? It's hard when you try to get me. <laughs> what do you think? Is it delicious? Am I the best hot chocolate maker in the world? Everything fell into place. Now, I normally wouldn't recommend these types of movies, but it was serious. Alright, Warren, you ready to pick up Claire? I got. So in life, there's a rule that a lot of people don't understand, and it's the rule of risk and reward, where sometimes you can take a risk and you get a reward out of it. Now, at other times, it's not worth the risk to get the reward. Now, here, let me let me illustrate this. Okay, so you see in life, we have risk and we have reward. You see there is a fine line in between risk and reward where you take this risk and then you get the reward. Now in a lot of situations, that line stays there. You take the risk, you get the reward. Now sometimes, the risk can be small, this little risk right here, 
and you get a bigger award. Then other times, you get this, where the reward is small and the risk is big. Now, the problem with this is that if you make a big risk, if you make a big risk for a small reward, it becomes recklessness. You see, me having the risk of going to that bottle drop, me going to that bottle drop for two dollars wasn't a good idea because it started to cross to that area where I've got all this risk for this teeny reward. Now, once we pass that center line, it becomes a recklessness. And I was reckless today, and it was a bad decision. So we need to learn to realize when it becomes recklessness, not risk for a small reward. You see, Casey Neistat has a really good video on this, and I advise you to check it out. I have it on the screen right now, and I think I also am going to save it as what's called a card by YouTube now, or if you're on a mobile device, you can click that little I button that's up there somewhere. And that will allow you to be able to um, watch the video that he made. Uh, it's called The Day I Almost Died. And Casey Neistat, I love him to death. and uh, I really think you should start watching some of his stuff. <laughs> This right here, this is my room. This messy, gross, 